Hello welcome to Nautical Navigators. Today in this video we shall be discussing about how to make a free gyro north seeking. How to make a free gyro north seeking. A gyro is a spinning wheel or disc that maintains its orientation in space, regardless of the movement of its surroundings. A free gyro is a gyro that is not fixed to a reference point, and is free to move in any direction. When a free gyro is set in motion, it will continue to spin and maintain its orientation in space, due to the principles of gyroscopic stability and inertia. This means that if the Earth is rotating beneath the gyro, the gyro will appear to be rotating along with the Earth. To make a free gyro north seeking, we need to control two free movements of the gyro, its tilt and its drift. Tilt is the angle between the gyro's axis of rotation and the vertical axis, while drift is the tendency of the gyro to rotate around a horizontal axis. By placing the gyroscope with its north axis pointing towards east the axis will tilt up as Earth rotates, we can create a top-heavy effect using a mercury ballistic or fixed weight. This effect causes the mercury to flow from the north bowl to the south bowl, applying torque to the upper end of the axle, resulting in precession towards the westwardly. After applying top-heavy effect, the gyro is a controlled gyro but will not settle in a fixed direction in any meridian but will oscillate. The gyro must settle down and maintain a fixed direction with respect to the earth, which should also be stable. To achieve this stability, we need to introduce precision in the direction perpendicular to the original precision. This can be done by introducing another torque perpendicular to the first one, causing drift in the direction perpendicular to the original precision. To achieve damping and tilt, the point of application of the force should be placed slightly to the east of the vertical, resulting in a component of the same force producing a torque about the vertical axis. The resulting precession about the horizontal axis will reduce the amplitude of oscillation, allowing the gyro to finally settle in the meridian. By applying the appropriate torque to the gyro, it can be made north seeking. The gyroscopic precision and inertia will then maintain its north seeking orientation. Whether a gyro is top heavy or bottom heavy depends on the maker. To achieve maximum precision, it is important to remove any remaining drift and tilt by applying the appropriate torque. I hope you liked the video. Kindly like, share and subscribe and keep supporting. Thanks for watching.